Jesus says, Chaos is coming. Beware of the mark of the beast. June 22nd, 2023. Words from Jesus through Sister Claire. Spoken by Jackie. Claire began. May the Lord prepare our hearts and may we all receive this message with sobriety. The Lord is coming very soon. In one of Ezekiel's visions, he keeps seeing sheep, small clusters of them, and even entire herds, being scattered and rushing headlong off a cliff. The Lord will explain the meaning of this. As you know, the military has been deployed all over the United States as protection for the upcoming war that is going to spill over on us, the attack that is going to come from Russia and her allies for our involvement and for poking the bear consistently. It is coming, it is estimated, that 400,000 Chinese immigrants have crossed over the Mexican border, all military age, and you know, we have cells here too in America, waiting for the signal to unloose their wrath. But the Lord is more concerned with our souls right now and where we are at, because people are going to be in complete disbelief, shock and despair, because the media has been hiding this from us. And only people who listen to alternative news really Pay attention to what is going on. Everything we hear from the regular media is turned upside down, lies, the exact opposite of what is going on. Okay, so let's go back to the sheep being scattered and plunging off the side of a cliff. I asked the Lord what the meaning of this is, and he said, Chaos is coming financially, with war and pestilence, and the Prosperity Church is not ready for this. They have not been properly prepared for what is about to happen, and they will not be able to deal with it. My people, you are not ready for what is coming now. Your preachers have tickled your ears with the very things you want to believe, yet are contrary to reality. War, pestilence, poverty and death are coming to you, and you must prepare yourselves now with true repentance for your sins and a complete amendment to your lifestyles. Feed the poor, tend to the broken, heal the broken hearts, listen to those you have shunned in the past. They need to be heard, they need to be fed, and they especially need authentic love. Remember, when you look into the eyes of those who are suffering, you are looking into my eyes. I am there, present to you, pleading for you to show mercy and be accountable for your lifestyles of waste and excess. He has been dealing with me over things that I do not need to. There is hope for you, but it depends on your heart and what you value and support versus what you avoid and abhor. These broken souls among you are my provision for your mercy in the hour you will need it the most. Those who stop to help, for them I will stop to help. Yet those who pass them by, them I will pass by as well. This is the hour for you to repair the damages you've caused by your callous and selfish lifestyles. The time is now, very soon it will be too late for you. Your country has been sold to your enemies. As a matter of fact, Ezekiel had a vision of the United States, a map of the entire country, and in bold letters across the front of it were the letters SOLD written. We have been sold to China and other nations as well. 
but we have been sold out by these politicians that have been elected because people didn't know any better. They did not look behind the smiling face and find out what they really believed and what they were really doing. Jesus continued, Your country has been sold to your enemies, and soon they will overrun America, leaving a path of destruction in their wake. Even as it is written in Scripture, before them lies an Eden, and behind them only desolation. At any moment, your people will be shocked and stunned in disbelief, as the first nuclear device is detonated on your soil and all those teachings on peace and prosperity will be exposed for what they are. False prophecy, manipulation of the masses to continue to lull them to sleep as your enemies populate your country and prepare to overtake it. Yes, there are hundreds of thousands who are battle ready to take your nation and kill you and your families. Yet your best preparation is a clean conscience repentance and a complete turning to God. There are some among you who will choose the beast system because it will promise you prosperity, freedom from debt, as well as freedom from persecution. I am warning you now, even as the scripture warns, take the mark, go along with the program and your soul will be lost for eternity. That means you will never see your children again, your pets, and you will be in a place of eternal torment. Please be warned now, it is going to be overwhelmingly tempting to give in to the demands of the government that is going to rise out of the ashes from all over the world. The world is deliberately being destroyed and put in a state of chaos so that one person can come forward, the Antichrist, to declare all the solutions and begin repairing the damage. But he will betray the people and even as it is written in the book of Revelation, halfway through that seven year period, he will turn around and betray everyone. That is the Antichrist. That is what he has come to do. He will be inhabited by Satan for a brief time, so everyone will be rushing for security, stability, freedom from debt, the promise of a new life, and that is precisely what the new government will offer everyone if they will just sign on the dotted line. So be warned ahead of time. Really difficult times are coming. Cleave to me. I will give you the strength to make the right choices. Do not look back when you leave the world. Do not look back, only cleave to me, because heaven is waiting for those who are faithful until the end. <laughs>